Here we go. It's time. Hello, everyone. It is Monday, February 11th in the year of our Lord 2013. How are all you doing out there? I have to be loud for my uh, camera. How are all you doing out there? I am doing awesome as always. Wicked awesome. It's Monday. It's Man Love Monday. I know the lighting is not the best, but hey, you got to go with what you got. I told you I was going to record live from the Wharf Pub restaurant, Eggertown, Massachusetts, Martha's Vineyard Island. We've got the lovely, gorgeous Heather Hill behind me. We've got the lovely, gorgeous birthday girl, Kristen Tidmar Sarujo. Looking finer than a new set of snow tires. Oh, and then we've got my man, George Austin. Absolutely wicked awesome man. In fact, by the way, a new unofficial sponsor of the show, George Austin. Fine craftsmanship, fine carpentry. There's your contact information below. If you need construction, if you need build something built right, you call George. He will hook you up. He will fix you up. And come over with a pint. And come over with a pint. Damn right. Uh, my good friend Crystal Lloyd Lozani, KJ Lloyd, a down gold copy. Great way to start the day or the night or whatever have you. She's a 50 style pinup model, published poet, and she knows it twice. She's an aspiring uh, actress, and she's um, absolutely awesome. Din Star, Danger is no stranger to an age ranger. And my last unofficial sponsor of the show, my good friend Tom Walker. Walk, not walking, not walker. Steve Rubber Rubber Stamp and Sign Company down here in Yeehaw, Texas, where men are men and the bulls run scared. Texas is like a whole other country. They can legally become their own country. But. He makes all kinds of stuff. A lunar, he makes um, laser engravings, banners, rubber stamps, candy wrappers. Sure, he'll make it. Magnetic signs, vinyl letters. All right, folks, you know what time it is. It's the time for the beer of the day. And today's beer of the day has already been poured because I'm in a bar. Wachusett Blueberry Eel, Westminster, Massachusetts. Look at that. It's got blueberries in the beer. Freaking awesome. So cheers and beers to all of you. Crosses, they say in Germany. Kumpai, as they say in Japan. Cheers to George. There's my man Tim D. Felice, fellow graduate of Martin Luther High School, class of 1992, as is the lovely Kristen. And then uh, that's my brother in law, Josh Hinson, a wicked awesome fella indeed. Marrying my sister. There's the lovely Kristen. We got more in store for her. Oh, we'll get to that in a moment. Let's hope on the blueberries. Beer is good for you. That's right. That's okay. <laughs> See, beer is what keeps me looking young. Hey, I'm 39, feeling fine, and looking the good, looking good to those that are blind. That's right. All righty. Now it is time to get to the uh, birthdays of the day. Right off the bat, the lovely, gorgeous, sexy, wicked, awesome. Mwah! Kristen Tidmash Arujo, the better half of my man Jay Arujo. Over here. You need to bring your ass over here. Oh. Now see, <laughs> hey, easy killer. Now my now my friend Jay, I've known since I was a fetus. All right. Was a fetus. <laughs> now this is this is Kristen's better half, or lesser half, Jay. He's an He's awesome guy. Half. This guy is absolutely wicked awesome. Lives in lives on Mid Middle and Ave, Vinnie Haven, Massachusetts. He's known me since we moved. To Vineyard Haven back in 1975. Uh, mm -hmm. He's one of the originators of the street and an absolutely wicked awesome guy, there wicked awesome friend. Oh, Love this guy. Martha's Vineyard Beach <laughs> High School class of 1987 mm -hmm. with my sister in law, the lovely, gorgeous Melissa Reynolds Baker. That's right, my brother's better half, no doubt about it. But Kristen, happy birthday to you, sweetie. Thank you. I can't believe she's the age she is. Graduated Martha's Vineyard Retail High School class in 1992. She doesn't look it, does she? I'm 29. She's 29, and she is fine. Wicked fine. Wow. Wicked. Oh yeah. So, so Kristen, cheers and beers to you. Happy cheers birthday. Cheers and beers and blueberries. It's the, it's the first time I've ever had a birthday shout out on the show with me. If that ain't awesome. I don't know what is. Well, actually, my daughter. I forgot about that. She's really awesome. <laughs> my daughter is awesome. Cheers and have a beer. All That's right. True. So, next birthday shout out goes to my man Ryan Phillips, a comical nav wizard I worked with in jolly old England. He's an awesome guy, ultra cool, laid back, chill dude. Ryan, how you doing? Happy birthday to you. Like I said, we're recording live from um, the bar, the wharf, Eggertown, Massachusetts. 
on Martha's Vineyard Island, the greatest island in the world, the greatest state in the nation. Without Massachusetts, they wouldn't be in America. Remember that. Woo! Christmas, yeah, yeah. Christmas Addicts, March 5th, 1770, started it all off. And then, of course, December 16th, 1773, the Boston Tea Party, because we didn't want to put, pay tax on on your bloody tea. <laughs> okay? And then we all know about April 19th, 1775, the Battle of Bunkers Hill fought at Breed's Hill. Hey, without our great state and our great friends and their ancestors, we wouldn't have a United States of America. That's why the New England Patriots <laughs> should be America's Hi, team. Heather, come Hi, here. The lovely Heather Hill, she is stunningly Bye. gorgeous. <laughs> and she works here at the wharf. Or no, she did. did. She she just resigned <laughs> tonight. tonight. <laughs> you know why? You want to know why? Because they couldn't pay enough for her to work for them. <laughs> Heather, Thank you. representing class of 1992, awesome, awesome stuff. Total sweetheart. But you have to say that Will didn't decide that. Right? Will did not decide that. <laughs> the owner of the bar, my good friend Will Coogan, shout out to you. Hey. For having us here. He let us do this. And uh, Will couldn't be here, unfortunately. He's another graduate of Martha's Vineyard Regional High School class of 1992. Where's my 1991 graduates, you know? Come on. Yeah. They're all busy getting smart, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> but anyway, right, Ryan, right. hey, man, didn't mean to interrupt your uh, hey, shout-out, but you know what? Graduates. You have a wicked awesome day. Party hard and enjoy. Celebrate young. like it's 1969 minus the acid. <laughs> All right. Bye, Pass this one on to my good friend, we'll my old buddy, Larissa Lillard, a cop that I worked with in yeah, jolly yeah. old England. We hung out in Bible camp together, yeah, and uh, we found God, learned all kinds of scripture. And uh, congratulations on everything that's going good for you. I hope you're doing well. Cheers and beers to you, Larissa. You have a wicked awesome day. Celebrate well and enjoy. Happy birthday. Next birthday goes to my man, Ken Collier. This guy... Hey, how come you're not playing the old uh, song pop anymore? Come on, God hates a coward. Come face the nation of annihilation, if you dare. Well, Ken, great work with you in good old Japan. A great country indeed. Maybe the best country in the world. A badass crew dog. Missed the hell out of you, bud. Always a pleasure keeping in touch with you. You have a wicked awesome day. Celebrate well and enjoy. Here's an island birthday that you guys didn't know about. The lovely, gorgeous Sabrina Leaning. She's around somewhere. It's her birthday today. That's Happy right. And uh, she's a fellow graduate of Martha's Vineyard High School, class of 1990. Yes. Stunningly gorgeous. I haven't heard from her. Unfortunately, the last time I heard from her, Russia was still known as the Union of Soviet Socialist Republics. It's been that long since I've heard of Sabrina. Well, she's around and she's singing. She's fierce. She's singing? Yeah. 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 No way. Yeah. Well, how come I haven't... No kidding. Yeah, yeah, all over the place. Well, you yeah. better tell her hello for me. Sabrina and the Groovers. Yeah, she plays Sabrina the and the Groovers? Groovers. 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 Yeah. Groovers. Got yeah. it. Grooving, baby. <laughs> Grooving. Like like um, the Rascals sang back in 1967. Yeah, Except right. Sabrina sings even better. And she's a hell of a lot more gorgeous than they were. But hey. Nice. See, he knows what's up. I'm, that's my man Jay Arujo for you over there. Woo! Arujo Brothers in the house. And if you got a business card for your business, you need to hook me up. Uh, if somebody needs a business card for their business, they got problems. They better call them quick. <laughs> <laughs> Way to go, George. Way to straighten this guy out, huh? I'm telling you. You had to straighten me out. Yeah, we got about 10 people over here. We've even got a graduate of Martha's Vineyard Regional High School class in 1993 who's shy. The lovely, no, gorgeous, oh, hell no. oh, hell no. oh, hell no. the lovely, gorgeous Hi. Missy Kanoya, a total sweetheart of a lady, and uh, she looks the same she did 20 years ago. I'm serious. I hadn't seen her in a long time, but she's still the same. That lovely smile, beautiful hair. Okay, okay, you're making me feel bad. There you go. And look at her. See, see. It's hard to believe she graduated 20 years ago. She looks like she's 19. <laughs> hey, 19, about the same average IQ of a Yankee That's fan. How old my son is. <laughs> Your son's 19? Yes. Wow, I'm feeling old. Um, wow. Her son's 19. Funny I mentioned 19 years old. <laughs> well, Sabrina, I hope you enjoy this show. I hope you watch it. Happy birthday to you. A big hearty cheers and beers to you from Reverend Dr. B to you, which much love. And tell, tell your mom and sister hello for me. 
Her mom's so awesome. She's awesome. Yeah. Yeah, she, she's it, still kicking around. She's so yeah. I see her. She she's is. out at the Ritz every now and again dancing. She was right next to Jay's mom. Get right out. Yeah. The neighbors, no kid. Yep. I miss her. She was always so positive <laughs> and cheerful. <laughs> no surprise. That's Fabulous. <laughs> All right. Hey, how about a uh, melon coffee? Melon coffee and melancholy. Happy birthday to our uncle Crystal, my uncle Tim. Today he would be 54 years old. Sadly, he passed away two days after February 11th. On February 13th, in the year of our Lord 2004, from cancer. Cancer, let me tell you something. I got a big fat GFY for you because you freaking suck. But anyway, Uncle Tim, I hope you're watching from up above in a better place. I miss you. I love you, bud. And uh, that was our closest uncle. You remember my Uncle Tim Baker, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, today would be his birthday. Wow. Yep. I know. Nine years ago today, he passed away. Well, not he passed away two days after turning 45. Really sad. All right. With that said, we got some additional shout outs. And I got to give a shout out to the Honorable Chris Bradshaw and his better half, Sherry. I knew her, Sherry Reed, another fellow graduate of Martha Virginia yeah, Reed High Sherry School class Reed. in 1992. I did her hair for their wedding. You did their hair for the wedding? See, Kristen did their she hair for the wedding. Here, but she couldn't come. She, she couldn't, couldn't come because Kristen. Did you really? We should go bust um, her out of work. Did Sherry's working man. right now. She's Chris, I borrowed Chris's Helmut. Yeah, that's right. The old school Pat Patriot. Chris Bradshaw. You get the Love Doctor salute for letting me borrow your Helmut, and uh, thank you very much. And uh, Sherry, stunningly gorgeous, total sweetheart, and uh, great seeing you guys last night hanging out with you. Give a shout out to the, um, we got to give a shout out to JB at Sharky's. That was some damn good food last night, absolutely phenomenal. You guys truly reek of awesomeness. We but, reek and we love it. You're damn right. <laughs> Hell yeah. If you ain't loving it, then there's something wrong. But hey, Chris, Sherry, you guys are totally cool. Ultra cool. And a uh, big shout out to the two of Utes on the beer and song of the day. Much love to you. We all love you. Even this guy right here, the Honorable Tim D. Felice. Yeah, he's not on camera. He's chicken. He was on camera before. That's right. Well, he's going to have to bring his ass back because he's ultra cool. Hey, we got to give a shout out to our boy Jake Borkow. Jake! Jake! Also known as, what was his name? Dan Sawyer. Yeah, come here. <laughs> Tell it. Otherwise known as, you can tell a story. Bring it. Otherwise known as Dan Sawyer, as he Dan had on Sawyer. his name tag at the 20th reunion. Really? Hey, hey, yes. Dan, Dan Sawyer. No kidding. Yeah. Ah, Jake, you sneaky <laughs> son of a gun, you. Always been ultra cool, man. How you doing? Hope you're doing well, man. I know you would be here if you could. You'd be in there like a thong and a fat chicken. But hey, you know what? We know you're here in spirit. Jake's here in spirit. We miss you, Jake. We do miss you, Jake. We miss you big time. Hey, a big hearty cheers and beers to Jake. Brother, you have a wicked awesome day. Celebrate every day like I do. If the day ends in a Y, it's a good day. Period. Dot. End of freaking story. Mm. Next on the list, we've got ah the lovely Christy Herman Crow. Oh, I do her hair too. You do her She's hair fabulous. too. Fabulous! Heck yeah, I do. Damn right she is. <laughs> now she was unable to make it, obviously. But hey, Christy, great chatting with you as always. Great keeping in touch with you. Wanted to give you a random shout out, saying how you doing. Hope you're doing awesome, wicked awesome, <laughs> and uh, much love to you, girl. Always a pleasure. You. Enjoy the show. Have a big hearty cheers and beers. Pour yourself a good adult beverage like I've done. Well, I didn't have pour this one. It was poured for me. How cool <laughs> is that? Stepping up in the world. Even though he popped Sophisticated, huh? <laughs> Christy, you, you have a wicked awesome day and enjoy the show. And then finally, we got to give some love to our good friend, the late, great, ultra cool, wicked awesome, despite the fact that she was a Yankees fan. Hey, she's a Buffalo Bills fan, and oh, I like the I and I like the Bills. We miss her. We love her. She's up above watching over this right now. She used to watch the show every day. Her and I talked about sports all the time. The late great Danielle Miller. Danielle Miller, Danielle Miller Kylie, Danny, 
Everybody and needs her husband it. just wished me a happy birthday. Are you serious? Uh, uh, Norman oh. Norman just, no just yeah, said happy birthday to, wow. to uh, Kristen. Wow. Folks, we need to gather around, give some love to Danny and her daughter, Brianna, who's kept Danny's memory alive. Thank you so much, Brianna. I'm coming over here for a cheers for Danny. Cheers for Danny. And look, her husband right. just can't here, look, see it. Yeah, I'll bring it. it. Nope. Bring right. it. Watch this. This is, oh, shit. It'll happen. There you go. Angled Scroll correctly. a little more. Husband just wished me a happy birthday. Happy oh, birthday God. from Norman, Kylie, Kylie, to uh, the lovely Kristen Tidmarsh. Norman Tripp, Kylie. Norman, you're an awesome guy, and I know... Hey, we got to give the love doctor salute. Salute properly. Salute. Cheers and beers, Norman, Brianna. The entire Kylie family, much love to you guys. Danny, we love you. We miss you. God bless you. And a big hearty cheers and beers. And hope you enjoy the show. I know you're watching from up above in a better place than we're at. Hey, Martha's Vineyard is pretty awesome. But heaven's even better. Damn right. Damn right, Reverend Dr. B. All right. So with that said, there's our shout outs. It is time. For the ladies to get emotionally erect. <laughs> we can do that? Uh, erect wow. uh, you ever heard of Erectimus Nippolis? Oh well, yeah. celebrity birthdays, right off the bat. The great Burt Reynolds. He's 77 oh, today. Still handsome. And he's a hairy Sasquatch. Yes. But, but I love his wool sweater. Hey. <laughs> Wait, do you see the picture? Look at that. Oh. Porn stash indeed. <laughs> Hell yeah. Burt Reynolds was the quintessential stud muffin of the 1970s. Smoking in the Bandit, legendary movie, 1977. And he got the, he also got to plow Lonnie Anderson. How cool is that? And we know us guys loved Lonnie Anderson back in the day. Look at that. men's men, um, Sunday Express magazine, Burt. Reynolds, squeeze me. I don't think that's his middle name. Well, it is now. <laughs> Burt Reynolds. Burt Reynolds. Burt Reynolds or Burt Reynolds? Burt Reynolds. Hey, there he is without the mustache. Deliverance, 1972. Can you squeal like a pig? A classic line indeed. What did he do best? What did he do best? Oh, God. <laughs> Show off. Yo, yeah, oh, he showed off well, too, as you can tell. But look at that. I mean, look at that porn stash. Ultra cool. Hey, next month is Mustache Madness Month, folks. Don't forget. But Burt Reynolds was a legend indeed. Still is. And, uh, hey. He's even got glasses now. But, hey, he's doing well. you got to love There's a young picture of Burt Reynolds for you ladies. I know. I'm getting there. All right, let's get to the... Um, <coughs> Celebrity birthdays, babe of the day, coming up, Jennifer Aniston, a total gorgeous babe, 44 years old, how about Jennifer Rowland, she's 32, Cheryl Crow, 51 years old today, we've got Brandy, the singer, 34, Thomas Edison, born this day in 1847, sadly passed away in 1931, but he was 30, 84 years old. I mentioned Burt Reynolds, 77 years old, still going strong. Sarah Palin, it's her birthday today. Oh, She's nobody gives a shit. Right. What a milf. 49 years old. Tina Louise. Tina Louise. Tina Louise. Yeah, hey, you. That's right. Gilligan's Island. Ginger or Marianne? Marianne, because Ginger was a bimbo. Because Ginger was a bimbo, but Tina Louise is 79 now. Wow. How about Ava Gabor, the late great Ava Gabor, born in the state in 1919, passed away in 1995 at the age of 76. Uh, Green Acres is the place to be. Uh, Matt Lawrence, born in the state in 1980. Bobby Boris Pickett, if you don't know who he is. Well, let's do the Transylvania twist. Monster Mash. That's right. It was a graveyard smash. Born in the state in 1938 in Massachusetts. Passed away in 2007 at the age of 69. How about the late, great Leslie Nielsen? Passed away three years ago at the age of 84. He would be 87 today. Um, author Sidney Sheldon, born in the state in 1917. Passed away in 2007. And then Senator Lloyd Benson. Passed away at the age of 85 in 2006. He was from Yeehaw, Texas. 
otherwise known as Southern Louisiana, um, Southern Oklahoma. But see, here's the thing about Lloyd Benson. The quote of the day, he said to Senator Dan Quayle, you're no Ted Kennedy. That's right. Jack, you're no Jack Kennedy. But anyway, so let's get to the um, random facts of the day. On this day in 1978, China lifted a ban on Aristotle, Shakespeare, and uh, Charles Dickens. On this day in 1878, um, the first United States Bicycle Club was formed in Boston, Massachusetts, the greatest city in America. On this day in 1809, Robert Fulton patents the steamboat. That's right, February 11th, 1809, the day before Link, uh, Abraham Lincoln was born. On this day in 1990, you, you all remember this one well. James Buster Douglas knocked out Mike Tyson, the biggest shocker in boxing history. And boy, that screwed up Mike Tyson for life. Look at him, he's a freaking fruitcake now. Yeah. On this day in 1942, Archie Comics debuted. How about that? On this day in 1935, 11 degrees below zero, Iframe, Morocco, African record low all time. On this day in 1899, 15 degrees below zero, Washington, D.C. The coldest ever. Same with February 11th, 1899. <laughs> 61 below zero in Montana. Wow. On this day in 1895, it was 17 degrees below zero. Brasmar, Grampian, United, United, United Kingdom record all time. On this day in 1752, the Pennsylvania Hospital opened. It was the first hospital in the United States of America. And I'll drink to that. Woo! Drink, drink, drink. Don't end up there. Drink, drink, drunk. That's right. Folks, with that said, you know what time? That's my wife's message. Answer the fucking phone, bitch. <laughs> That's my friend Jeff Fontaine calling. I'm not going to answer it. <laughs> my wife's a character. I'm telling you, you got to be a character to be married to this fruitcake. That's right. Sorry, Jeff Fontaine. Much love, brother. Oh, God, I forgot to give a shout-out to uh, Maria Fontaine, his better half. Maria Fontaine, absolutely gorgeous young lady. She is celebrating a milestone birthday. Hard to believe she looks 20, but she's actually 40. She ain't afraid to tell her age because she is gorgeous, total sweetheart. Maria, Jeff, big salute to the two youths. You have a wicked awesome day and your lovely three children. Jeff, I haven't seen you since 1995. My friend Jeff is actually going to um, visit my brother and I on Saturday. I worked with him in the Air Force in California. Yeah. Oops, I mentioned what I do. Oops. Uh, I've never mentioned that on the show. Oh, there's a lot of firsts. Time. Who cares? Hey, I broke I, I broke the seal. <laughs> hey, I deflowered it. You popped the cherry. <laughs> I popped the cherry. That's what I was trying no, to get in. <laughs> Excuse me. You <laughs> All right, well, anyway, we got to get to the song of the day, and we're going all the way back, way back, to a great year, 1948. Since it's Monday, it's Blues Monday, as we all know, right? And who's one of the greatest blues singers of all time? Muddy, Muddy Waters. Muddy. See, how'd you know that? The late, great Muddy Waters, a.k.a. McKinley Morganfield. Born February, uh, April 4th, 1915, passed away April 30th, 1983, at the age of 68. This song is one of his early ones. 1948, the song is called You Gonna Miss Me. Because, folks, we're all gonna miss each other. But, you know, the memories will always remain. Thanks for the memories. The song is You're Gonna Miss Me. The late, great Muddy Waters, 1948. This is blues at its finest. Here we go. And how about a hot babe of the day? I know Kristen should be the babe of the day. She's a lot hotter than this woman. But this woman ain't bad. Jennifer Aniston from Friends. She's 44 today. And she is not a dirty whore. 44, not a whore. But she's looking wicked awesome. There you go. I don't know how well the song's coming out, but Jennifer Aniston kind of looks like a whore there, though. Look at that. Doesn't she kind of look like a whore there? Like, just saying. Erectimus Nippolis on that one for you folks. 
Kids, this episode is not for you. <laughs> oh, they're just trying to finish their. Well, they're welcome to join the show. It's okay, he's got his helmet. They understand. <laughs> Thanks, Crystal. That's for safety. That's for safety. Hey, I'm practicing good safety. There you go. Jennifer Aniston, topless, can't show the nipples. We're going to wrap up in some hand wrap after this. They're welcome to join the show. A stranger's a friend you haven't yet met. <laughs> like every good old school song, you have a good Facebook. Instrument. Oh my god, I love it. You have to check it out tomorrow. Don't that forget, hey, I, I've got I got media friends for WEI Sports Talk Radio that follow me. Whoa. My friend Sal Capaccio in Buffalo, New York, he follows me, WGI 550 in Buffalo. Then you got Johnny Vaughn in Chicago, radio station out there. He used to work for WG, oh god, WGN, thank you very much, yes. Yep, he used to work out there. So, WGN Chicago, he used to work out there. Wow, Jennifer. Hey, we're having a blast. Like they said, like they always say, get busy living or get busy dying to quote the late, to quote the great Morgan Freeman. In Shawshank Redemption. That's my favorite movie. That is such an awesome movie. The movie of the day, folks. Shawshank Redemption. That's your quote. That's another quote. There you go. Jennifer Aniston with no clothes and a bow tie. That's right. That's song of the day. Good stuff. Look up beer and song of the day. Thank you so much. Thank you. You take care. Have a wicked awesome night. We will never lose that. Either. Nope. Never have. Never True will. True New Englander. Even. Even I'm more a tr- than that. Hey, I've been a mass hole longer yeah. than you, buddy. <laughs> there you have. That's right. Well, there you go. Some of us perfected it, though. <laughs> I don't have uh, the accent. All right, John. That's don't what I'm missing. Not at all. Just, oh, no folks, I got, I got one, one more special thing for you. Yeah. You beer connoisseurs out there, you booze bags and booze baguettes. This one's for you. This is how you properly drink a beer. I cannot do this, but I'm going to bring a man on the show now. My future brother-in-law, the Honorable Josh Hinson. Okay? This guy. Watch this. His nickname ought to be Hoover because he can suck down a beer like nobody's business. Yeah. This right, is everybody's watching. Like hey, like should we do a ziggy zaggy ziggy zag? Oi, oi, oi. Ziggy zaggy ziggy zag. Oi, oi, oi. Ziggy zaggy ziggy zag. Oi, oi, oi. Get over here, George. Holy crap. Wow. Holy mackerel. Holy smoke of roosty. You did. Folks, if that ain't awesome, I don't know what it is. I hope you got that off, because that was so freaking That was freaking wicked. That was two goals. Ultra cool. Folks. Damn right it was. Hey, folks, you know what time it is, right? Damn, Damn right, Reverend Dr. B. Folks, it's time to make like a fetus and head out so everybody take care. Have a wicked awesome night and day. Peace be the journey. Woo! Don't do anything I wouldn't do. Don't drink and drive. You might spill your drink or you might kill yourself or somebody else. And drinking and driving is dumber to be in the Yankees fan. And what's dumber than that is rooting for douchebag cocksuckers like Eli. Oh, I'm as good as Tom Brady. Manning or men slapping women or racism or animal abuse. Things like that are just plain stupid and definitely deserve a big fat GFY. Folks, I'm out of here. See y'all tomorrow. Talk to you later. Bye bye. 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 Hey, Justin Dimmitt, I kept it under 30 minutes. Justin Dimmitt is my uh, creator of the Beer and Song of the Day Facebook page and my executive producer, my um, my um, executive producer of the show. And then I got my good man, uh, Kevin Sherman, living in Schaumburg, Illinois. Shout out to you. Thank you so much. He's a, um, he's the, um, 
um, creative consultant and assistant writer and assistant producer of the show, and then the lovely, gorgeous, wicked, awesome Sarah Milligan, because she is the art director and the graphic designer of the Beer and Song of the Day Facebook page that takes care of your Hunk of the Day album. Justin takes care of the Baby of the Day album. Folks, I'm out of here. See you all tomorrow. I'll talk to you later. Bye bye. Chicken grease. Come here, Kristen. <laughs> One more. Oh, shucks. Peace, love, and hair grease, Peace baby. Peace be the journey. Peace, Peace. love, and, Peace, oh. love and hair and grease. <laughs> yeah. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.